vacationers, welcome back to another video in the Las Vegas series. Today we are checking out Old Red, Blake Shelton's restaurant that has opened up here in front of the Horseshoe and the Bellagio is on the other side of the street. There are a handful of Old Reds around the US. There's about five or six of them, mainly in Nashville and Florida and Orlando. But now they have it here in the West Coast in Las Vegas, Nevada. Views, the food, and a few drinks. And we're gonna be joined by Dad K and Jeff from J and K Stay in Vegas. So let's check it all out. They really did a good job putting this up. And it says, come on cowboy, roll the dice. Your boy was playing craps earlier. It's a four floor building. They erected this thing really fast. If you're not familiar where it's at, right below the horseshoe LED screen. Now, right now it's super busy. Look how many people are here are lined up. There's that Gation. Before we continue with Blake Shelton's Old Red, I would like to take the time out to thank today's sponsor, Golden Nugget Online Casino. Are you looking for the ultimate Las Vegas experience but not willing to leave your own home? Did you know that Golden Nugget now has an online casino app where you can play all of your favorite games? Wow, you can play all these amazing casino games right on your phone. Hit me, blackjack baby, let's go. I am partnering with Golden Nugget Online Casino to tell you about this exclusive deal that they have. All new customers who sign up using promo code JCATION and deposit a minimum of $5 within the first seven days of signing up for the app will get $50 in casino credits for the app. You heard that right. With a variety of slot games for you to choose from like Cleopatra, Fortune Coin, and a bunch of other exclusive Golden Nugget online casino games, I promise you, you will be entertained. Head on over to the Golden Nugget Casino app right now and use promo code JCATION and start off your Vegas experience. Gambling problem? Call 1-800-GAMBLER or visit 1-800-GAMBLER.net. So this is their merchandise store and they have a ton of old red gear, but also Blake Shelton t-shirts. Look at that, they have a pick that says old red honky tonkin. Back to the honky tonk. And they have some Las Vegas stuff. They even have some uh, barbecue rub down there as well as keychains. I like this shirt. Y'all ain't right. Old Red. Well, howdy, J. Kationer's Cowboy Kation here. Don't worry. I won't, I won't let Cowboy Kation come out for too much of this video. Nice, fabulous Las Vegas trucker hat. Genuine country music. And then they even have like these uh, Vegas, well, they got a cowboy hat here, but they also have these like Vegas style cowboy shirts. Let's see what else they have here. Some crew necks. Look at this. Find me at the bar, bar, bar. I like that little slot machine pun. And here it is, the three floors of Old Red. Look at this huge tractor on the ceiling of this place. It hits buy a drink, keep the glass. You can get 20 ounce souvenir glasses and get their different types of drinks with the Old Red logo on it. Want to check out the menu? Right here. Hit that QR code. So with the QR code, you can get the menu. And they even tell you who's on stage. Ryan White Maloney from 2 to 5 to Tonight. It's gonna get loud here because they have live music constantly throughout the day. But in between sets, we will be showing you the drinks and the food here. And I do have a couple of guests with me today. Let me show ya. Hi guys, hi vacationers. How are you today? Super Bowl weekend. Team Tay Tay. There we go. What Team up, Tay Tay. Jeff? What up, vacationers? How you doing, bro? Swell. some old red. I'm ready to get down with some country. Shout out to Toby Keith, RIP 62. He was fighting a stomach cancer. Red Solo Cup. I feel you up. Let's have a party. It is Friday night here on the Las Vegas Strip. Glad I picked a country bar because the Kansas City Chiefs are my team because I bet 100 bucks on them plus 1,000 before the playoffs started. So I'm going full on KC Chiefs and everybody here looks like they're all about Andy Reid. Let's go, KC Chiefs. <laughs> Let's take a tour of the first floor here. So there's a lot of seating here. Low chairs and high chairs. This is the stage, of course. The windows are overlooking Las Vegas Boulevard and the Bellagio Fountains. This is the hostess stand and the souvenir shop that you can pick up stuff. And they also have a bar in the very back with those uh, chandelier string rope cowboy lights right there. 
they were nice enough to give me a sampler of Blake's seasonal beer. Let's try it. Ooh, it's a sour. It actually tastes like a uh, like a sour warhead, but I don't know if I want this. I might try something else. Yeah, we'll try something else. Oh, and I'm also wearing my Las Vegas Chiefs hat. Let's go, baby. So they have specialty drinks, it's 24 bucks. I'm gonna get the cowboy meal, but it comes with a souvenir glass. So I'm gonna get the souvenir mug. Cowboy meal, and the music's starting. $20 refills. Cheers, bro. All right, we're going to take to Mr. James Capson on this one. song is It's if lemonade had a lemonade. Good stuff. All right, guys, so we got the redneck nachos, tri collared tortilla chips, taco meat, white queso, corn, salsa, pickled red onions, pickled jalapenos, black olives, and avocado cream. Let's bite into it. Definitely tastes like a uh, Tex-Mex taco. They were Let's check out the second floor right now. So this is the second floor, more seating. And you do got a balcony seat. Another bar here. There's Dad Gation and Jeff right there grubbing on nachos. right here and a ton of beers on tap they also have Blake's hard cider a ton of cocktails bourbon whiskey vodka what is this oh you take a picture oh nice you can even put a sunglasses bandana to you music 
music sign here. Pretty cool lamp light design here with some country style boots and you're overlooking Las Vegas Boulevard and the Bellagio right here. There's your live music, a few boots. Let's look at the view here in the second floor. Ooh, I like the tassel thing right here. There you go, Las Vegas Boulevard and the Bellagio Fountains. Two aces right here in the second floor. All right, we're going up the steps here. That's the Grand Bazaar shops. <laughs> Look at this, okay, these are the different locations that they have old reds. Orlando is 2,300 miles away. Gatlinburg's 2,014 miles away. Nashville's 1,792. Tisho Mingo is 1,195 away. Pretty cool, having these murals. There is like a link style Ferris wheel here. We're going to the third floor. There's the horseshoe where we're staying. Wanted, the old red dog. Look at this, another full-size mirror, but you got Las Vegas showgirls with pasties as the design of the wallpaper here. Look at these spikes up top. All red Las Vegas, Nevada, and it's a little like a, a lineup for the when you're arrested. So there's a bar here on the third floor and more just like a standing tall tabletops here. They have a couch here, a couple of lower level seats. But mainly everything is like a round table with higher top seating. Third floor right here and there's also a full bar for draft beers. And this is the third floor balcony and you're overlooking, look how much traffic there is. This is Super Bowl Friday night. You got CBS Sports over there. That's the Flamingo Road right there and I love how Caesars Palace had lights up on their side of this tower and you have long bar seating here with a bunch of red tall chairs and a few tables down here it's cold out here guys it's like 40 degrees right now look at all the traffic this is about six o'clock on a Friday night and there's the bridge that will lead you from Old Red to the Bellagio man this traffic is crazy guys and then on the side of the third floor you have a screen here and your horseshoe screen and I think this stairwell here leads to the top floor I'll tell you what guys the view Views here at Old Red are pretty cool. We're only on the third floor. We're about to go to the fourth floor rooftop, and apparently there's a table called Table 777, just like my Facebook page. Las Vegas 777, let's go. Check it out, follow it. We have 4,000 Las Vegas lovers talking about the newest things going on around Vegas. Let's go to the rooftop, and then we're gonna try our main course. Man, they built this so fast. Red bricks up here in Old Red. Oh, they're playing some ZZ Top right now. I love ZZ Top. All right, let's check out the fourth floor. It looks more loungy here. You got some wick stools, a couple of uh, lounge chairs, more wick seating over here. But look at the views you get. The waterfalls going on, but man, that traffic looks like New York City right now. Holy crap. There's canopies up here, so if it's raining, it's covered. But they also got heaters. And this is the special table. Table 777. It's the very corner of Old Red. You could sit about eight people here, but look at this view. Look at that. You get a piece of Paris right there, the new Versailles Tower, and the horseshoe sign, and Caesar's Palace and Mirage. <laughs> Look at all that standing water from the rain the last few days. These heaters are a savior this time of year. The brand is called Bromike. <laughs> they even have a stage here. This looks like more of a VIP area. A lot of seating. Your old red dog TVs that are showing the live feed and the live music. Music, and then another bar here, cocktails and beers and everything. So this rooftop bar, starting at nine o'clock, I'm guessing Friday, Saturday, Sunday, they have a DJ here. And this is the only part of Old Red that is open after the restaurant closes down. And you have another 
balcony area here with the Dre's nightclub and the Cromwell Flamingo Horseshoe. Look at the lines downstairs. There's your Grand Bazaar shops. All right, we're gonna head back down and try our main course, guys. There is an exit right here. Second floor, you could get out to the bridge straight to Bellagio or the escalators here in Las Vegas Boulevard. This place is pretty cool. I'm liking the views here and the sheer size of this spot is huge. Really cool place to hang out and have some drinks and some dinner. The wallpaper here are a bunch of different types of mini dice. And there's your full mirror to infinity. Back down in the first floor, let's try out some of the grub. All right guys, I got the Oklahoma onion burger. I already took a bite of it because you have to watch our channel. And uh, it's got lettuce, tomatoes, pickles. I got the, the whole burger without the tomatoes and pickles. So this is medium, still a little pink inside. She did. She told me last night after she left your room. Uh, <laughs> it's good. Nice and flavorful. There's a french fries. On point. I like this. On point. This is the trash talking taco salad. That Cajun's going to try it. It's got taco meat, tri-colored tortilla chips, romaine, lettuce, corn salsa, black beans, aroma, tomatoes, shredded cheddar cheese, black olives, pickled red onions, jalapenos, lime, avocado cream, chipotle ranch. This reminds me of like a huge Taco Bell crunchy taco in a salad bowl. We'll see what Dad Cation thinks. Absolutely pretty good. Tomatoes are sweet. The ground beef is a little dry. Yeah. But it's okay. We got some like corn salsa, like some avocados, some cheese. Some, some black Same taco meat, right? As yeah. nachos. As the nachos, exactly. Yeah, yeah. So it's kind of like the nachos in a bowl. Exactly. That's exactly what I was gonna say. And you got the black beans here too, which I'm not a fan of. Too. Right. <laughs> well, overall, I think it's okay. It's got an okay from Dad Cation. Seven out of ten. I ended up with the pulled pork barbecue sandwich, vinegar slaw, pickles, and a potato bun with tater tots. And the tater tots look a little different. I gotta get some ketchup with my tater tots. So. Looks like buffalo nuts. Buffalo nuts. Let's try it. Try it out. in here and a bunch of meat with the coleslaw and a potato bun. It's actually really flavorful. I recommend this. Blood Brothers at Resorts World, I think I'd say that's better, but this is still pretty good. Nice option. I'd probably ask for a side of barbecue sauce to dip a little bit of the brisket in that falls out. This is actually really tasty, nice and flavorful. I'm gonna try Dad Gation's Taco Bell salad here. <laughs> Get some greens in my life here. I can imagine this is what like a Texas salad tastes like. Very Tex-Mexy. A step above Del Taco, a step above Taco Bell. But they give you a lot. So you're not feeling like you're skipped out of your portion. They could also use hot sauce on the table. Maybe some Tabasco, but it's good. They also have avocado in there. I'll take it. Wash it down with the meal. Who's your favorite country artist, Jake Asianers? Comment down below. Mine is Chris Stapleton. Love that guy. So we're on the third floor. They actually have a small balcony here. A couple TVs, and it's overlooking the Grand Bazaar shops. Hey, this is a nice private area for the Super Bowl, and they do offer VIP packages here, and they even rent out the building for VIP events. Uh, West Virginia! Country home, country road, 
What are they playing, Dad Cation? Our family song. Yes. Your Uncle Jing is here. Uncle Jing, Uncle Bob, Uncle Rod. R.I.P. R.I.P. Jing. Brothers. Brothers. I gotta play it now. Three guys in the band. Pretty good. Just made it worth it, huh? Yeah. Hotel California dedication. Our song. <laughs> Our theme song. Manicus fam, baby! We're gonna get Dad Cation and Jeff's honest opinions on Old Red overall. Jeff, what's your opinion on uh, Old Red overall? Food, entertainment, venue-wise. I think the food was really good. I just wish the temperature could have been a little bit, you know, warmer, you know, when they bring out the food. Even though when you do some food videos and everything, it tends to get a little colder size, JJ knows. But I wish they could just have a little bit warmer, but taste overall was really good. Um, entertainment, really cool because you can see all the screens for the band from all floors. So if you don't have a direct view, like on the first floor, uh, you can see them all throughout the screens everywhere. So I think it's a great place during spring and fall this is gonna be really cool up here at the rooftop so I would definitely recommend definitely check it out thanks brother what do you, what do you think of this place it's a nice setup really nice but like what Jeff said wait till summertime you can't you can't be moving around here like we're moving right now <laughs> how are the views views nice the side has King of Hearts, Love Got Me Here, and Love Got Me Out. Well, guys, that was all red. I think that the entertainment value of this place is amazing, and it's huge. Four floors, the rooftop during the summer is going to be cracking. Live bands are amazing. The food here is decent. Like we said, the food kind of comes a little lukewarm, and it's not the best flavored food. But when you're here and you want to listen to some live music, have a few cocktails, it is a little more pricey, I'm not going to lie to you guys. But the views are amazing, the music's amazing, and it's a fun atmosphere. So if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to Jaycation, Jaycation San Diego, my new channel. Check out Jay and K Stay in Vegas. Let's get them to 30K in 2024. And shout out to Dadcation. Until the next video, in the words of me, stay traveling Las Vegas. Let's go! Cowboy Cation out! Y'all come back now, you hear?